What's up guys? It's your boy again come back to another video on this channel. So today I'm going to be talking about a uh, book that I was reading reading uh, called let me change my background actually. There we go a little bit better. Uh, called Can't Hurt Me by David Goggins. And I said reading for a specific reason mainly because I it was an audio book. I subscribed myself to Audible not a sponsor. I like using it. Best decision for me. Again, not a sponsor. But anyone working at Audible who hears this or listens to this, I will like to be sponsored by you guys, honestly. Full disclosure. But anyways, moving on. Um, so I know I did like a few episodes, or I don't want to say episodes ago, but a few, few um, shoot, what's it called? Uh, a few videos ago, I, went, I did a a uh, video on how everything yeah, so. is uh, the description and uh, the differences between audio and uh, video and uh, actual reading books, um, all that stuff. So I know I'm going to put that in the description box down below, as well as in the thumbnail here in the upper left or right corner, I think up here as well. So if you want to check that out. And um, overall, I like the book. It, taught, it shows you how to discipline your mind, how David Goggins went from being this weak, it, I don't want to say weak, but like lack of better words, this weak kid into joining the Air Force and like, and then leaving the Air Force, gaining, or ended up weighing about 300 pounds and then coming back down and joining the SEALs and going through Hell Week um, and all that stuff, fun stuff. So overall, it was a really good book. Um, I know a lot of people are against the idea or of um what should we call it of read or listening to an audiobook but again not a sponsor um but i i would like to be sponsored by audible but overall it was a good thing that i read audible um or chose to read audible mainly because it gave me a perspective that i didn't know could be um could be understood fully if I were just to simply read the book. Um, but I say that because if I, like the audio book gives, at least gave me an opportunity to like hear the emphasis of certain words and like understand from the author's perspective on everything about how he lived his life and went through his life, which was again, interesting and very awesome to hear, which again, I would, if I was reading, I would, be using my voice to read the letter, you know, like hearing my own voice. I mean, I don't think it would mean the same, uh, had the same impact as David Goggins kind of reading the book. But overall, great book. Storyline was good. It, it is a non, it is more of a biography, autobiography, or whatever the right verbiage is. And it was awesome. Like, 100% re to totally recommend. At least. I wouldn't say like at least reading it once or twice. I I mean I, I enjoyed the book a lot. So overall, out of 10, I'll give it a 10. Um yeah, that was it was that good. I think it was my first 10 on a book ever. But yeah, overall, definitely worth the read again. Everything tends across the board. That's what I'm trying to say with this. But yeah, overall, definitely worth reading at least once, if not more than once. It it helped me a lot with my own discipline, my own life. But yeah, overall, great read. But yeah, as always, in the, this is where I end the show. And as always, have a good one. See you next episode. Peace.